severe cooking gas crisis has hit the country. This resulted in long lines in front of gas stations, adding new burdens on the people. This crisis becomes tough as Ramadan sets in. This report has more details. A severe shortage of cooking gas trucks several regions of Yemen, multiplying the suffering of millions of people living in the war-ravaged Arab country. During the past few days, many fuel stations in several main cities ran out of cooking gas, forcing numerous bakeries to close their doors. Officials stated that the gas shortage continued spreading and included new areas under the control of the internationally recognized Yemeni government. In the southern port city of Aden, Yemen's temporary capital, many people were seen lining up at fuel pumps waiting to refill their cooking gas cylinders. Ahmad Jalal, a citizen in Aden, said that he spent several hours standing in line until he refilled his cooking gas cylinder and it's much less than what he needs, adding that his family needs at least four gas cylinders to cook food throughout the whole month. An official of Aden's local authority stated that, due to the ongoing war, the production of gas is not enough to meet the high demand of the local market. The inequitable distribution of gas also participated in creating this acute crisis, as some provinces get fewer quantities of cooking gas supplies than the others. In other provinces controlled by the Houthi militia, lack of fuel and cooking gas has had a terrible impact on local people's quality of life and created a new misery. Hundreds of vehicles are waiting in long lines in Yemen's capital Sana'a to get their tanks refilled as the ongoing fuel shortage keeps getting worse. Yemen has been marred in a civil war since late 2014, when the Houthi militia seized control of several northern provinces and forced the internationally recognized government out of the capital Sana'a. Martin Griffiths, UN Undersecretary General for Humanitarian Affairs and Emergency Relief Coordinator, said that according to some latest nationwide assessments by humanitarians, 23.4 million people in Yemen, or three quarters of the overall population, need some form of assistance. The war has also accelerated Yemen's economic problems, pushing more families into poverty, which is among the largest drivers of humanitarian needs. Yemen relies on commercial imports for about 90% of its food and nearly all its fuel and other essential goods. Fuel imports have also fallen sharply through Hodeida port. Fuel volumes in February were less than half the average. This drop is contributing to fuel shortages and price rises, which are likely to become even more acute as the energy prices globally continue to rise.